All right, guys. It is a spectacularly gorgeous night in paradise here. We're about a mile up the road from Bugs in a Jar Farm. And look at this hillside of trilliums. I thought that these things were white, although look at the shades of some of these. After they bloom out, I'm going to have to come here and get some of these beauties and transfer them to bugs in a jar. Man, I mean, there's millions of these things. By the beaver pond. The ducks on the beaver pond. The beaver pond's not looking too good. I don't know if something happened to the dam or what. But man, probably not showing up that well on this video. This is the most trilliums I have ever seen in my entire life. I did not know there were entire mountainsides of trilliums. <coughs> mm. That is just gorgeous. Just gorgeous. Taking the the Finger Lakes Trail Loop behind Bugs in a Jar Farm. I think Rob is somewhere out on his new brand new electric bike. Having a good time on his electric bike. Somewhere on this loop, we might pass him. But that's just about as pretty as it gets, those trilliums. Man, look at this. Now, these are white, so they've got the white ones and the pink ones. And the white ones are a little bit smaller. And Lord, these, uh, this has got to be the trillium capital of the world. I mean, there's hundreds of thousands. The entire, they're like a ground cover. I remember growing up in Georgia when we would find a trillium. How excited my mama would get finding one trillium. <laughs> now there's Good Lord, look at these things. On and on and on. I think this is technically the Shandaken State Forest. Outside of Ithaca, New York, maybe the Shandaken State Forest. So I guess, uh, me? 19th is the uh, peak of the trilliums. I'm so glad I decided to go take this sunset loop. Never would have seen them. Burning some fossil fuels. Getting out there and enjoying the wildflowers while I still can. I highly suggest you get out there and enjoy the wildflowers while you still can. My gosh. 